from the Mashamba West Mine in the Katanga. Now, I may be uh, uh, incorrect here, but I still believe that we're looking at pyrolusite here versus girthite. Pyrolusite is usually associated with manganese, which would be quite unusual for the Katanga. Um, dusting this as well, we have tiny uh, cobalt and calcite crystals. So this guy has various points of display, and what I love as well are these little fans on a cross section, these uh, what I believe to be pyrolusites make, uh, could of course be girthite as well. Perched on that are these little crystals of uh, Kolwezite, which uh, are named after the Kolwezi mining district in the Katanga. Uh, I, I, I'm not sure if it's a type locality, there are about 9 or 10 deposits worldwide, but I think some of the best come hail from the Katanga. From a display point of view, I quite enjoy this particular angle. You'll see my still picture it looks almost two-dimensional. It's actually quite uh, there on the background, sitting on top of the uh, 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 pyrolusite uh, uh, botroids, appear to be tiny cobalt and calcite crystals as well. So when we go around like this, there you have a whole formation of the cobalt and calcite crystals interlinked with those uh, cross sections of the pyrolusite. Let's have a look at the other way around. Let's look at this side. Okay, that's mainly matrix. So I would have this guy standing on a stand. So the view would be this going all the way around. Ah, look at that. Quite lovely. Or you could even have it standing like this. Quite, quite magnificent. All the way from the Mashamba West Mine in the Katanga.